just ignore them. I'm actually recording this right after, so this is going to be a pre-recorded video and everything. So, when you guys see this, uh, I'll probably, I will, I will, it means the first episode is already up. Um, at, it'll, be, it'll be Sunday when you see this video. So, no, 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 actually it'll be a little later than that. I'm pre-recording this because, hey, I, want, I don't think this thing has a saving thing, so my toolbox. I'll take my screwdriver. Well, it's the only tool in here. I should really buy more tools. <laughs> it's kind of okay. Now it's adding some comedy to it. Okay, can you the trash can? Can I do anything with it? Can I do anything with it? Can I do anything with it? Radio. It's a radio. Now it'll be more perfect. Here it now since it's in the rain. Yeah. Yeah. Fuck it. Let's go. Huh. Well, howdy there. Welcome to the Dayfield Motel. My name's Owen. Owen Bill. Oh, how how can I help you? Sorry, I'm staring. I'm looking to spend the night. Do you have anything I available? Well, I well I do have something. I ain't pretty, but it'll help up your head dry. Thank you. See, uh, can you call yourself? Why do you call yourself Old Bill for anyway? You don't look that old. Ah, son, ah, son, I'm barely fifty, and as a matter of fact, I just turned forty-nine the other day. Oh, sorry. You don't seem. I didn't mean to offend you. Ah, uh, it's okay, son. I ain't ashamed of my age. One hour. One more thing. All our phones in the room is working. But what? Come, come see me if you need an overall call number. A call number. If you need to make a call, if I need to make a call, I know who, who to see. Thank you. Let's see if there's anything in here I can work with. Computer. Better not touch it, son. Back here is for boy only. I me only. Sorry. So. I have to wait for this guy to leave then. So, what room do I go in? Should be in here, I guess, room. I need to see some first. What room do I go in? How big is this hotel? Can't do anything with it? Wait, there's something in there. There's something in there. Like this bottom. Okay. Where am I going with this? Ah, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh. I'm sorry. <coughs> I'm sorry, guys. I have allergies and stuff, you know. Well, isn't the pet, isn't this the penthouse suite? Oh look, they managed to remove almost all the stains from the bed. I can't do anything with it. Huh? There's an old bed balcony. Don't look. Don't that look safe? It's a no. Dear guest, please do not try to open the glass sliding door to the balcony. It's the lock has been broken for some time, and if we're forcing it, we'll this slot onto the door. That's what you're saying. Can't do anything with it. The balcony you can't even get on. I'll just go to bed. Well, I suppose there's nothing else I can do, else to do until the rain stops. I just fell back into the bed and gazed at the cracks of the ceiling. I thought I could finally ha have some time to myself. The more I gazed, the bigger the cracks would become. And it came too much for my. And it had too much on my mind. I wonder if Mary was okay. She would be. She would be opening up the diner about now. If I return to normal life, I'll ask her out on a date. Soon enough, I fell asleep. I felt cold, very cold, like when I walked into my mom's room. It's happening. I can't, I can't sleep. I need to know if Mary's safe. I'll call the diner. She should still be working. I need a, I need the out call number. Better go see the manager. Fuck! You gotta be kidding me. Already getting the call because you're fucking paranoid. Uh, huh? Where'd you go? Maybe I should look around. There's a strange look. The Bill's happy place. This guy has some issues. Okay, I got Bill's key and I got my own key. Maybe there's an out call number on his computer. And the password's protected. Great. It says, if I forget password, I'll find it, it on my birthday. Well, uh, that's convenient. That, that's strange. Cook someone has tried to enter the password. Better tamper with it. Must be a list of everyone in the hotel. Huh, only two people. Me and some other person named Paris Eve. Such a fancy name. Huh, Paris Eve. Gotta remember that. So we're gonna go here and do the normal shit. And sorry if I'm kind of out of it, I was just kind of watching Supernatural a few minutes ago, and I got to the part where Kaz was, uh, said yes to Lucifer, I think. I can't do anything with it. Oh, wait. Huh, this really feels happy place. Wow. Wait. I can't feel the happiness already. Why does this place feel, uh, serial killer-like? Can't do anything with it. Oh, looks like. Can't do anything with it. The note. Please do not touch the power box. Uh, it's to the right, I have modified the cables to charge my truck's battery. I can't do anything with it. I can't do anything with it. Old washing machine. Huh, it still works. What do I have in here? Coal. Oh, 
let's see what's on this workbench. It's an old can, oil can. I could use this thing on the bed in my room. It squeaks too much. So now I have an oil can. I don't see anything from here. Oh, there's a can. I could possibly use the blades of this mower. It could come in handy scaring up the critters at night. And now I have a fucking long a mower blade. Hey, look, the radio, that's not wet. Unless there's a fire, I can leave this here. There's a little floor hatch, a crowbar. Wait, give this a try. Look, okay, there's no one around here who say that. Should I give this a try? Hold, huh, maybe this. Nope, that won't work. Um, keyhole looks like it's busted. Hope this works. All those wires, uh, hey, jumper cables. Power box. Mm -hmm. Gotta find, figure something out here. So I figure out, let's go to the room. Try to figure something out. I like how this guy has a truck, of all things. Most people, most like horror game cliches have like a car or something. Well, don't look at that inviting. Uh, do anything. So you don't actually need it for the thing. Can I actually make a call yet? Maybe, great. Get password, find it on my birthday. Oh, that's convenient. That's strange. It looks like someone has tried to enter the password. Better not tamper with it. This is, just, I'm not a thief. Um, okay, okay, I get it. I just don't... There had to be something around here. What is there to do around here? Maybe there's a way to... <laughs> okay, I think I have an idea what to do with the, with the mower blade. Why does this feel like a serial killer, like, cliche? This is like Bates Motel here going on here, like, even though I've never really seen the show. Oh, I actually physically need the key all the time. I hate it when games do that, where you physically need to get the key in all the time. I forgot about the com combination thing. This should work. Yeah! Fits like a glove. Oh! Wait a minute. This girl. It's right next to this girl. And... Is this what I think it is? I don't see special about it. Holy shit. It's dangerous? I can't take a stick. It's just tape. This old girl's gonna get it. Wait. Is that? No! Oh shit! I need to warn her fast! Oh, well, 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 look at what we have here. You sick person, Bill. Who report you to the police? Tis, tis. Why would I do a thing like that for? I enjoyed the show just as much as I did. I have more than one people around here, sir. Don't have time for this. She's in great danger. I need her order. Not my concern, son. What are you? only bothers me is what's in your hand. The tape. Give it to me. No. No way, I'm calling the cops. Good luck with that dial uh, number. Oh god. Gotta hurry, gotta hurry, gotta hurry! Is there a way to like run faster? I hope it's not too late. Open up! Oh, you're not safe! Here's something. Door's locked, can't get in. Key somehow. Break the lock with the mower blade. Don't need this anymore. Here it goes. It's, uh, oh my, sorry that wasn't true, but, but, well, if you were gonna, you know, there's a better pickup line than that. Also, how exactly did you know that? Oh, there's a peephole in your shower. Great. So tits and all then. I was worried over my room, and I tried looking for the manager, but instead I found this his secret recording room. Yeah. What? Oh, here's his videotape from the room with you went on it. I'll take that. Thanks. Hey, listen. Don't worry about out. Um. Uh, yeah, I knew you were about to be eaten. If I knew and I'd bust your door down too. Didn't you think? Don't. Didn't you think you'd believe me? Well, I heard more convincing stories from guys getting in my pants. That's a skirt you're wearing. Well, that's a guilty... That's guilty on your face. And that's guilty face you're wearing. What's your name, anyway? Uh, it's Mark. Mark? Like Markiplier? <laughs> well, it's Mark, so I'm just gonna go with that. I'm Paris, and... But everyone calls me Barra. Sorry, Brie. It's just, why Brie? Because I like... Because I like the cheese, I don't know. Uh, it's, uh, it was just a nickname I had in high school. Look, I'm sorry to intrude. I'll, I'll leave. You got a car? Uh, yeah. Great, you can give me a lift to the next city tomorrow. And you can, uh, let me stay in your room seeing how you bust the lock on mine. Sure thing. Would you mind? Oh, sorry, I just, uh, went in outside. Okay! Sorry to barge in on achievement unlocked. Okay. Let's go back to my room. This is the weirdest fucking game ever. Alright, how would you get to the glass door? Again, I'm sorry about before. I honestly didn't mean for any of that to happen. It's okay, Mark, really. I'm glad someone told me told me the truth. And if I find that bill, I'm gonna break his legs and film it. Please don't break mine, I need to walk. <laughs> ha, you're funny, Mark. No, I don't break yours. Since you're cute, I'll, uh, I'll let you get any- get- get away with it. Uh, thanks, I guess. 
So where are you from, Bree? I have a strange... You have a strange accent. Oh, so so do you. I don't... I'm not going on with the details, but where I'm from, I'm from a place called Angle. So why are you... Okay, she's British, so I need to give her a British accent. So why are you here in the States? Well, I uh, say... I can't do a British accent. Well, let's just say holiday has gone wrong. So what you're heading up upstate for all holidays. <laughs> More like trying to get it away from home. Too many monsters back home, eh? You could say that again. Huh, you really believe in monsters, don't you? I wish I didn't. But it's hard not to when you see them. Mark, you are sure not on uh, medication. Oh, crack or... Cr cr oh, crack the crazy joke now. Look, if I see E1, I'll believe you. I hope you never do. Who were you going to call, by the way? Oh, just a friend. What's her name? Mary. And how do you know it was a girl? Oh, it, it's always about, about a girl. She work, works at a diner in my hometown. Well, you can use my cell phone if you like. Just keep it short. Thanks, I will. Hello, this is Angie speaking. Hey, this is Mark. Oh, you're the guy from the brown coat. Yeah, this is me. That's me. I can keep, speak to Mary, please? Sorry, Mark. She's gone home already. Oh, that's... Okay, I'll try again tomorrow. Let it go. She wasn't there. Hey, Mark. Do you love her? I'm not sure, really. I mean, I guess I do. I'll eat, eat you to it, Mark. What? Oh, he damaged the truck! Bill! Took my car battery. Guess that he's trying to keep us from leaving. Fucking bastard. Oh, boy, I have a weird feeling. It's not here, so he must be back in the room. Check this room. Oh, wait, not that room. The door, door is busted open, so it doesn't matter. Yeah, he's in there. So, so, uh, old Bill is in there, so we're just gonna do a quick round over. Now we get to old Bill's key. The question is, how do you get in there if I have to keep unlocking the fucking door? Oh, I have to fucking you. How do I get in? How do I get in? Where's the fucking crowbar? Don't tell me I can't get in. Don't tell me I broke the game. Uh, maybe I could use this to draw Bill out of hiding. She has something to use as fuel. Coal? This will work nicely. And light it. Too bad I don't smoke. Ah, oh, fuck. That means I have to go find something. Don't need that. Ah, uh, oh my. Huh, her lighter maybe. Hope she doesn't wake up or all. This will look bad. Wait, what other time? Better not wake her. But I really wish she wouldn't sleep naked. Such a distraction. She's not naked, she's wearing clothes. Ugh. Unless she's really fucking hairy, which would be scary. I'm just saying, although I don't mind a bit of hair, to be honest, but that's, that's scary if you're that hairy. Okay, I could use this to light the coal. What's that smell? I have started a, a fire up. Burn the whole hotel down. Oh, here we go, hiding. Just checking one in the office. So, um... So I have to deal with Bill, whoever he is. I like how we're dealing with a pervert now. So let's get Bill's key. Get in the room. The whole thing's a perv. Where the hell is Bill? Don't tell me I missed him. Unless he went into the fucking room. Let's get out of this place. Or I go nuts. The question is, where do you do with the battery? Don't tell me I have to get... Where am I getting the crowbar? Uh, how am I gonna pry it open? It was, does this make sense? Like, the car? Where's the fucking battery? Ah, okay, maybe I need to find a walkthrough. Okay, guys, um, I'm back, and I figured out where it is. It's in the fucking washing machine. It's always something when I'm stuck on this happens. This should do it. I thought it was my car battery. I must have stashed it in there so it can come right out. Huh, it's flat. Great, now. Uh, now I have to charge it. So, we gotta take the battery, charge the most unorthodox way of charging battery, but I hope it works. Okay, it should be enough just to start the truck. Oh, wait, it says on the car battery. Okay, soon I'll have fixed the truck and we should get out of here. Okay, I should wake up Bree. Get her the hell out of here. Okay, get the car, get the key, go get Bree. Wait a minute. Bill better not have went in there. Oh, Bree, the truck's fine. Bree? Are you okay? Watching the video you gave me. You were right. Bill is a sick fuck. There must be at least nine women on this tape. We can use this as evidence against him, but we must go now. Wait, what the fuck is that thing? That's the thing I warned you about. I thought you were joking. I almost fucking it almost fucking touched me. I'd be more worried about eating you. About it eating you. What is it? I'll explain later. But right now, we need to go. Okay, I'll pack my things. But you better explain that, Mark. Hello there. Uh, the lovely couple. Shit, it's Bill. Come on out so we can discuss these problems that you've caused. Bree, just pack your things and wait for me. I'll give you the signal. 
break it for the truck and don't stop it for anything. Okay. Well, Sunny so you cause him some blood. Ah! Damn it! I do this every time! A lot of problems. But you don't, don't worry. If you're my tent Ed gets here, I'll take care of you. And it's pretty grill you got there, too. Hey, we're leaving, Bill, and there's nothing you can do to stop us. See? No, we're at the... No, you don't. I don't understand. See, you're going to leave, and I don't... And I have a gun in your truck's battery. And in your truck's battery. I'll see you have ten minutes and you can work those for me. I won't... I'm, I'm warning you. I'm warning you now, Bill. Let us go and I promise you'll live. You'll let me live? Your chances are... I love your chances, son. Mark, what's going on? There, uh, there you are, pretty little thing. Ready to have some fun? This guy's a sick fuck. This game went to a dark turn. Last chance, Bill. Move an inch, son, and I'll shoot her instead. Don't, Mark. Dad. Huh? Dad? Mark, it ate him! Come on, we have to go now. That's Dad?! I didn't expect this to happen. Any of it to happen. Bree now knows the truth. What do I do? I can't keep her... Can I? Mark, start explaining. What's to explain? You've just seen it all. You know what I mean. Dad. Oh, that's... that's nothing. You gotta be fucking kidding me. I just watched the guy eaten by a fucking creature, and you still call it Dad. Speak, or I'll fucking stab you. Wow, so persistent and violent. Don't test me. Okay. Yes. He is, or should I say, was my father. So why, why don't you look like him then? Because it's not, because it's, because I'm not dead. Okay. No more. But I want to know, you can't just give me that explain without an explanation. Please, Mark, tell me. Why does she want to know so much about me and my past? Look, if you want to know, I can't, if you want to know, I can't tell you. Why? Because you because I will show you. I have fallen to a deep. I have fallen too deep with this girl. She knows way too much. She wants to know about you. All about all of you. Don't worry. I promise. You will get to meet her her soon. So, are you going to say anything, Mark? Oh uh, no. Oh no. Okay, Mark. Where are we going? To somewhere that people shouldn't go. Oh, where's that? New York. That's the wrong. What's wrong with the Big Apple? And is it? It's a place where mo the monsters are born. Monsters are born there. Yes. So why are you going to that place where we should very likely die? There's also a guy there that can't help. He can explain it all to you much better than I could. Just who is this guy? His name is Dan. His name is Dan. Dan, huh? So what's he like? I don't know. Never met him. <laughs> okay, so we're going to see a guy you've never met to learn about the monsters. Well, I can just drop you off there and get... Get to Vegas. We can get to Vegas. No way. I can't. I don't want. I want answers since I, you just dragged me through all that. Well, it's your funeral. Hey, Mark. Did your er, fa did your father die? Uh, he killed himself. I'm sorry, Mark. It helps my old man died when I was young. What happened to him? Well, he dr he owed some guy money. He was a big gambler. He sold everything we owned to pay it back. But unfortunately, it wasn't enough. He was shot dead in front of me. What happened to you? How come it didn't shoot you? I, I hid in the old fireplace in the living room. Huh. They didn't see you? I hid in my dad's black jacket. I'm sorry. I just had been uh, very traumatizing for you. Oh shit happens. There's nothing you can do about it. Yeah, it does. Always for a reason. You better get her going, or I'll put anal leave in 12 hours. Here, my, my ship out uh, oh, for the drink. Ink. Uh, you sure you don't mind I'm paying? No, it's cool. Saves you an excuse for ta taking me to, to taking me to bed. You seem like you're really open to the woman. Well, when you get used and abused your whole life, that's their what's there to hide. Fair enough. So did we just get? So did we just did we just get laid or something? Um, I knew they were following me. But Bree, there's no there's so much to, for her. I don't understand. So it could be so similar yet so different. Is he getting laid? That's my question. Maybe this is a mistake. I'll have to decide what to do with her once we see Dave. Okay, now we're on a plane! Comfy Mark? Uh... Oh yes, Mary. How did you manage to get the business in class? Oh, you're kidding me? Oh, Lord, that's how. Oh, I get the picture. Oh, okay, I get the picture. I like how this is very sexist, in a way. It, hey. But, I have to say, it's kind of very sexist, the way she portrays herself out. So tell me, Mark. When you mentioned that thing in the bar about your dad, Yes? Why did you lie to me? Were you 
you mean? Can you provide you? Or some kind of twat? No, no, I know. Mark, I know when someone's talking bullshit. How did you probably die? Mark, no more lies. But I ex expect the same from you. Okay, sure. My father died because of me. I You killed him? I came home from school one day. I heard screaming coming from upstairs. I peeked into my mom's room and saw him beat him. He hated him beating him up. So I prayed for him to stop. Then they were getting worse. So after I seen the, the monster to do what he did, so I've seen, I seen the monster do what he did. So I, after I seen the monster, that monster do what he did, I went to the kitchen, grabbed my dad's gun, drool, and shot him. I never meant to kill him, I just wanted him to stop. Mark, I know, I'm not that great of sympathy, but it's not your fault. It must have been in any way. way it is. I could have called the cops. My mom planted it. A knife on him to make him look like he was trying to kill me. I'm sorry, Mark. I shouldn't have asked. Look, forget it. I was going to go get it off my chest. Okay, I'm going to use the knife. Huh? Bathroom, Mark. <laughs> oh, you uh, want me to come with you? It's just basically happens. Okay, I keep doing that. Mark, you can join me in Mile High Club next time. That's not what I meant. I'm sure you didn't. I'm sure you didn't, but I'll be back soon. God, this girl's perverted. Reminds me of myself, almost. I'm not joking, I talk like that. I am in public, I will talk like that. No, I'm not supposed to. Oh wait, we're playing as Bree now? Okay, that's cool. So, where's the... Let's find the laboratory. Okay, this is the pop... This guy is all by himself. I could really use a smoke. I should all regret the girls' laboratory. I better cover up the smoke detector, though. I got nothing to say. What is that? Hmm. I guess there's a stop oh, passenger smoke. I don't need it. What do I have? Okay, I have duct tape. She has a lighter of smokes. There we go. That should work. So, okay, I just had to combine them. Christ, I needed that. Two fucking hours until the reach New York. This is my my last smoke. Perfect. Oh, good for now. What do I mark like to be? Give me the video tape. Good. I should trust him, should not Anyway, I should be heading back. It doesn't look too friendly. Let's leave him alone. Just to be sure, I'm gonna go this way. What the fuck? Where did everyone go? Good work. Just go for help. Mark can't go that way. The fuck just happened? Where, where's Mark? Hello, is anyone there? Uh, anyone? Yes. Hello, is everything okay? For God's sake, is there someone flying this thing? What's the emergency? There's no one on the plane at all. Passengers are gone. That's impossible. Where, where are they go? Look, I can't leave the cockpit, but you need, you need to stay calm and find out what's going on. Me? Yes, I said it, and I can't leave. Someone needs to fly this thing. You need my help. Just please cut communication panels and I'll try to assist you. Okay, I'll see what I can do. This is fuck. Okay, can't have all this beer. Wait, I made it up. The economy. You should still be there. Good, you're still here. Wait. Why didn't you disappear? Can I help you, young lady? No, no, it's okay, thanks. Nonsense, you seem distraught. What's the problem? Have you been asleep this whole time? Everyone's gone. Huh. You've landed already. No, they're still all flying. And no one on this plane besides you, me, and the pilot. No. And who are you anyway? Air Marshal Neeson. Oh, good. So are your cop. Eh, sort of. And you are? My name's Bree. So can you help me then? Sort of. It's the question, too. What do you mean, sort of, help me? Well, I mean, unless you can prove your case, I'm staying right here. I'm a jerk. Everyone is a jerk in this, but you have a but a few will show it. The fuck am I doing then? Don't need that. What is this? It's locked. Mac. So what can I do for now? Is there anything with it? Maybe they're upstairs or something. I just went. The hatch above is locked. This is for air personnel only. It can only be unlocked by the air cockpit. Uh, God damn it. Bree, you're not helpful in this situation. What can I do to get this stuff? Because this is really frustrating. And I don't know why. Oh, shit. I need to figure out the problem. I'll find something. I gotta find something. All I got is a lighter, so you can go down, asshole. Well, was Bradley still there? Yes, I am. Have you found anyone yet? Yes, I found one passenger so far. Although he seems cool like a prick. So you met Mr. Neeson? You mean Air Marshal? Yes, he, a good sign. This is a good sign, at least. He said he won't help me unless I approve of the situation. Yeah, he can be very stubborn at times. He won't even get off his seat. Okay, so let's see what I can do. Fine, fine. 
I'll unlock the overhead storage just outside my door. You might find something useful there. Thanks. Why is that empty? At least the thing's unlocked now. What is that? It's a digital camera. Maybe I can use this to show me some proof. Shit. I'm going to battery left in this thing. I'm going to have to take a photo of it. Shit. The camera doesn't have enough charge to use flash. What's this? Let's see. Black screen. Wait, no. I still have some battery left. Don't worry. I'll believe you. Really, why? Why? You're on so far. I had a peek at the section of the head. You really are a brick. Want some help or not? Yes, I do. Run it. Speak with the pilot. What should I do? I want you to check on the luggage compartment. Hear the rig hear the plane. I have a pilot unlock for you. Gee, that sounds like fun. Good, so you have probably be fun night then. Oh boy. Now they ever had me in a wild goose chase to figure out shit. There? You seen how your voice coming from? Great, I'm using the voice system. I need you to come to the cockpit. There's something you need to see. I think I have a bad feeling about this. I need to see Mason first. Great. Now the chair that's lit and is empty. You said, what's going on? Where the fuck is the pilots? That's what I wanted to show you. There's no one flying this plane. Shit, shit, shit! The pilot was right here. I was speaking to him about 15 minutes ago. Interesting. What is it? The man, or I should say pilot, that you spoke with. You know his name? Yes, he did. He doesn't even know. Doesn't he need to know it? He did. Doesn't he need to know it? He does, but... I only met him a few hours before I take takeoff. He called me decent twice and once in Nathan. So what does that mean? How could he remember my name all, name all the time? All the time. Because I wrote it down or something. Maybe you wrote it down Bree, that wasn't the pilot you were speaking to. Who was it? I don't know, but I should find out who fly this thing. Autopilot it won't last forever. Can you fly this plane? Well, I can do is arrest it. What the fuck? All the times you crack a wide ass joke now. Do you check at the lunch department yet? No, I haven't. Tell me when you find and I'll, I'll read you the instructions. Okay. So now we gotta go back. Again. I go all the way over there and I have to go back. Yeah. Oh my god! What the fuck has happened? Why is he dead? Mark? Huh? What the fuck is that thing? Stay away. Oh my god. I'm gonna die. Ah! Huh? I'm alive. Bree, can you hear me? In the pipe? The car ahead of you. Bree, find anything? Yes, I did. You're gonna believe me. Okay, we're going. The monster just attacked me, huh? See, you don't, you don't believe me. What did it look like? Uh, it was huge. It had tubes coming out of its head and its neck. And worst of all, a giant smile. That didn't, that didn't look like anything like I saw. What? I saw it. You saw it too? I've seen something. Not sure what it was. A small little white guy with no face. Oh god, were there more of them? I'm afraid so. What do I do now? Let's see what you can find. Okay. The trail book. Um, nope. Freak. Hey, their right mind won't follow the trail. Yeah, I guess you should tell me somewhere. There's nothing here. Marie? Is that you? Mark? Mark, are you down here? Oh, thank god the main character's not dead. And it really, like, disappointed me was dead. I guess you have to follow the trail. I just hope it doesn't end in Mark's blood. So, luggage. We're gonna ask about that. What the fuck is that? A candy bar? Just dropped it. Where are you, Mark? What's in here? Maybe I can get Nisa to open it. Let's see if it's alright. I uh, can't believe I have to go all the way back to Nisa. Ugh. This is the longest, like, plane. What is. How long is this plane? Because I've never seen planes this long. I've never been on a plane this long, to be honest. I never have. Yeah, I've been on some long planes, but not this fucking long. I've never even seen planes with three fucking seats in it. Three rows of seats. Which is something I've never seen. There's something running through the vents. Huh? What do you mean, you mean by that? A mouse? What was that thing you saw earlier? Well, it was probably nothing. What do you mean, nothing? We were all... We are all for... Tell... Shh. Sounds like me. It's, it sounds like me. Just ignore it, Marie. It will leave. It will be. Why is it hiding under the chair? It seems to be sensitive to light. It's probably why it's running through the vents. What do we do? It seems fixed on you, Marie. What is that? That's not yummy, yummy skin. 
What's my... Hey, he's pointing to your pocket. What's this? It must be the, like, candy. You don't think it, that the candy dripping from his mouth? But uh, probably give it to him. Where are you go? Now, fuck off. Oh, he's gone. I found him out in the open. The pilot. Press play in the b black box corner. How, how long now? Really? That long? So then, when did the storm show up? Who's he talking to? Just wait. Everything's in check. Why is the smoke sensor going off? Oh, whoops. Hang on, there's something at the door. We do have a passage of heat. Flying routine out here. Jeez, you're covered in blood. Quick kidding. Hello? I need instructions over here. Excuse me. Who am I speaking to? Kobe. Sorry, your name is Kobe Cat? Look, I need... What the hell is that? No, don't go near it. I don't care if it looks hurt or it doesn't look safe. What the fuck? Stay away, get off me! Ah! Oh god. At last, I came through this hatch. That means I had to walk right past him. He didn't seem to notice me. It seemed interesting in some fellow named Mark. That's my friend Mark. I have to find him. Where did he be? There's a big door in the luggage compartment. I think that this passage door leads straight into that room. Through the vents. I'm not going in there near that thing. Maybe you can drop out of the vents. That what? Try to find some more candy. Okay, I'll see what I can find. Means I have to go on goose chase for candy. Ah, oh, great. Wait, the storage rooms. Duh! What can I find it here? Fresh packs of batteries. There's always found candy. No, there's no storage room here. At least those were the shot. No. Get away from the dead body. At least it measures a sensitive light. The batteries! Uh, okay, the batteries fit. How the hell do I get this running? Ugh, god damn it, that is so hard. Fresh, uh, knocks in the day. Wait, does that mean I have to leave? I gave it the camera. I guess we have to go back to what's his face. Ah, I mean, I go all the way back again. I forgot the fucking problem. Hold on, I'm gonna pause one more time for. Okay, I actually went back and looked at the corpse real quick and I found a candy bar in his pocket, so we're actually gonna use this to lure it. Maybe if I leave this candy bar here, it'll keep him out of the vents. I hope. I don't want to be near that thing. I don't need that. Okay, so we got that figured out. So we're gonna, um, yeah, we're gonna try to figure this out as best we can. To get the fuck out. Carpet. Got him out. Huh? What the fuck? Where did the Neeson go? I hope that other thing didn't get him. Someone needs to fly this plane. So he went upstairs. Not up here. I mean, they're probably gonna find his body somewhere. Where the hell is he? Are you kidding me? Again with this shit? Uh, this is some serious bullshit, is what it is. So back to the cockpit. Right? I didn't mean to go out, dumbass. Why is it doing that? I don't understand why it's doing that. There's nothing else in here to work on other than the door. Stop! Hold on, I'm gonna try to figure this out. Hold on. Okay, guys, uh, I, I, I guess I just found a bug in the game. Until I can figure out this bug, I guess I'm gonna end it here because I've been on for this fight for like an hour and I need to stop and go get some sleep. Anyway, guys. I'll catch you guys later, and I stay dirty, my friends. Bye-bye!